Hi, I'm Brad Tone and I'm represented by Shard Management. Uh, I know that you're not accepting submissions at the moment, so I thought I'd um, do some monologues to show my range. This one's by David Tennant. I'm a Time Lord. I'm from the planet Gallifrey. I'm 903 years old and I'm going to save your lives. Hello, my name's Mark. I am the casting assistant here at Castycast. Uh, today I have been told, I, um, I have been given the opportunity to uh, call back all of our recent uh, auditionees and tell them uh, whether or not they've got the job. Um, so I will be calling 4,999 people to tell them it's a no. Um, but we prefer to do it that way here at Casticast and uh, give feedback if can. And uh, I suppose I, I should be able to get it all done in the day. And I, yes, yes, I, I do see it as a valuable use of my time. Thank you, Dante. Max Forrest here, reporting from my isolated patch. Now, many people who are self-employed are currently left without a means to make money. But whose industry is suffering the most? With little opportunity to perform live, we're speaking to a couple of musicians who explain why it's worse in the arse. Arts. Hello, is that Will? Hi Will, it's Mark from Castacast. I got your number from your agent. Yes. It's about your recent audition. Oh no, sorry, it's a no. Yes. But we are doing some feedback, if you like. Oh, lovely, good. Yes, it's um. eyes too close together. Does that help? Oh, you didn't want the job anyway? Oh, good. Well, you take care, and hopefully we'll see you again next time. Uh, oh. Well, that's one down. <laughs> Quite a few more to go. Thank you for speaking to me. I don't get many visitors, so it's nice to have somebody interested in my work and what I've created. When people see my work, I want them to think that's been done by a professional, you know? May I show you some pictures? A layer cake with vanilla frosting. And what you're interested in is the frosting, I bet. Well, when I make it, I like to get right down and spread it all out evenly. Sometimes I tilt my head and look across the top, see if there's any peaks, and even them all out. And after that, it's onto the topping. Strawberries here. But you could add chocolate buttons or, or M&Ms. I like banana. You know, you could just chop it up and put it all out on top. And
And once you're finished, she's ready for the big day. Frosted. I've been doing this Jane Fonda workout. It's basically just bending over and reaching through your legs and that. Makes me feel sick. Anyway, back to it. <laughs> Hello there. Philo McQueen here, the author, writer of dramatic monologues, BBC, ITV, rather. Now, Today's offering comes to us from a delightful young actress, uh, such joy in the face. And she's going to be reading for us a monologue which I have entitled, New York, New York. Continue. Do you remember the first time we met on that Walmart photo shoot? You looked over at me from building ovens. You looked over at me with those eyes. One eye on my body, another on my mind, and another on my soul. Those eyes that say, hey, baby, baby, come over here, baby, baby. Then we walked through Central Park together. You played your xylophone and I sang. Oh, I felt free. Free me again, fluffy bear. Free me into the dusty air that surrounds us. <sighs> oh. Fantastic. Join us again, won't you?